the royal visitors stepped off into the hot sunshine of Nairobi. No one knew then that the girl who had arrived here as Princess Elizabeth would leave again five days later as queen. Well, this is the spot where young Princess God Elizabeth the became queen, queen back in 1952. We're about three Queens hours drive of out of Nairobi in Kenya. Kenya. And this spot here is where a huge tree used to be. Up high on. in its branches were a series of runes. Old. It was a place, wow. a private spot for the Quite royal family to come blessed. to and to see some of the wildlife the on this Lord watering hole Lord. out here. The Treetops Hotel was burnt Kingdom down Kenya. just two years later. Yes, and very few of those people who were here at the time are still alive. But we spoke to one man, the the daughter, who was just a young man as he helped her with her bags yeah. so all those years ago. I was in peace many people on Twitter and online that I that to mourn the queen. She found me at the bathroom or, uh, and asked me to help carry the luggage. Or I visited some of the up to inhumane here. arts uh, down to the colonies. And she was walking as well. By British. Oh, not to kill on a Maguru. East Africa. South Africa. Yeah, she was a young, beautiful yes, lady, and a, a her husband, going on online, but he was a big man. Yeah, it was now, they famously said at the time that she walked up the stairs into this treetops hotel as a princess and came down the next morning a queen. While she was up there, overnight in the UK, her father had died. Rest in peace. Although this was the spot where she officially became yes. queen, she didn't know it. She hadn't realized her father was she dead while she was staying in this Queen treetops hotel. Mario it was only when the royal party went back London, down the road to what was then a royal residence, what's now I mean, a state here. residence here Rest in, in Kenya. Peace, That's Elizabeth. when the message came through and Prince Philip had to break must the have news. Been devastating. At that point, they headed back to Britain mm, I mean, for it's her sweet to news. take She's up very, her very role queen, but she has lost Queen of her England. Father. Commemorating some of the Queen's Elizabeth II, uh, the second uh, moments we see here, she's drawing food to a, uh, a bunch of, uh, Af uh, is it African? I don't know if it's African American, but they are definitely black. And this has raised a very huge debate online on whether to celebrate the Queen or even mourn the Queen. And uh, or should we take this moment to uh, criticize the British government for their uh, atrocities? Mm -hmm. What do you think? Pictures that we I mean, saw of family members arriving at Balmoral really said it all. This is a family um, in mourning now, uh, and um, of course, people, millions, the Queen was a mother, a world, grandmother, and a great queen. grandmother. It's obvious, it's I think precious, it is quite telling that Prince, Prince Harry travelled solo to Balmoral. He took, we understand, a flight on his own. He was not accompanied Meghan by the Duchess of Sussex. I think that is and, uh, deeply significant it, that well, Meghan was not invited to join the family by the Queen's uh, bedside. Royal, Duke right, Cambridge flew to Aberdeen as quickly as he could, leaving Kate behind. Of course, this was um, Prince George, Princess man. Charlotte and Prince Louis' first day at school. So she made a very family. difficult decision to uh, stay behind, to be Queen there, the to collect the children. Uh, we know that this is a rift Charles between and, uh, the I mean, royal Prince brothers William that runs Prince deep. Harry. We know it is a rift that has caused the Queen a great over. deal of pain. And the brothers will be together at Balmoral. This is Will the first time they have been together, and um, really since the Duke of Edinburgh's funeral Queen. nearly 18 months ago. Mm. And mm. I suppose everyone will time. be will be hoping mm. that there can be some sort of a reconciliation. Elizabeth. It's just a tragedy that it comes across the Queen's deathbed. Queen's but I do think this is a family who will now be united in grief. Harry is in Balmoral. I think the decision was made for Meghan not to be there, probably to make this very difficult and what will be a highly emotional family the reunion and the queen possibly was easier it, uh, for the rest of the family. I think inevitably uh, is there is going know, to be speculation four, about whether or not this really started to, tragic to passing of the Queen, a very sudden passing real. of the Queen, yeah. and given that only a couple of days ago she was meeting the Prime Minister, the queen, I think supporting there is every the hope that, that this will hopefully country. trigger some sort of a reconciliation between these she two brothers who for the past 18 very months elegant, have really been brothers at war. The outfits they are just lovable. God. 
Bless the Queen.